Well, Happy New Year out there to everybody. It's January 2024, and it's time to go through which exams have retired recently in the Microsoft world. Yes, Microsoft did go through some uh, exam and certification retirement on December 31st. So let's go ahead and let's get moving into that. So this isn't really anything new this past year. It seems like Microsoft has kind of been on a rampage with their certifications. They've been getting rid of all kinds of certifications. In a lot of cases, they have been condensing certifications, but in some cases, they have been just all around getting rid of. Now, before I jump in and show these to you, I hope you'll give me a like and a subscribe. I'm trying really hard to give free content on this uh, channel, and um, I do give away some of my courses uh, every month for free and if you ring that notification bell you can be uh, one of the people that get those for free I usually give it away to a hundred to two hundred people at a time so uh, I hope you'll do that also I have a discount going on right now for all of my Udemy courses if you go to examlabpractice.com slash courses all of my courses are listed here if you click these links the coupon code is already added and uh, you can get a discount okay so let's talk about the uh, the retirement of their exams and certifications. So we'll start right here with the exams. We go to this little uh, link here, this learn.microsoft.com link, retired certification exams. We scroll down, you can see that in February 29th, they do have the MB300 Dynamics exam, Core Finance and Operations, that's retiring. But what I really wanna focus on is the newly retired uh, certification exam right here. This is the one everybody's upset about right now, the MS-203. This is Microsoft's messaging certification. Now, Microsoft has had a Microsoft Exchange certification for over two decades now, and they've just decided to get rid of it. It's gone. Um, whether or not they're going to come out with another one in the future, I don't know. I know there's a lot of people complaining about this. So it could happen, could happen because of all the complaints in the IT industry right now with people complaining about there not being a messaging or an exchange type certification. But yes, this certification, this exam is now retired as of December 31st, uh, 2023. Now I will tell you, if you do have that certification already, okay, you are allowed to renew it one more time up until June. So they are allowing you to renew that certification up until June. Now, I do also want to address one thing. I do have that course as part of my catalog, my MS-203. I have converted this MS-203 course to just the Microsoft 365 Messenger Administrator course, and I am going to continue to update it. I am not getting rid of it. I'm going to keep working on it, and I will continue to update it. So um, anybody who is the proud owner of that course, uh, I hope you're a proud owner of it at least, um, just know I'm going to keep updating it. Okay, so that is one of the big ones. As of December 31st, that's gone, and of course with that went the Messaging Administrator Associate Certification. Now the other certification that has gone away is the Teams Application Developer Associate. Now that is not the Microsoft Teams like specifically certifications. So don't freak out. That's not the MS 700 certification that a lot of people get. This is the uh, Teams Application Developer Associate certification. So that uh, has officially gone away. Okay, and that went away with the MS 600 exam going away. So those are your two big ones as of January uh, 2024. All right. Uh, your MS-203 exam, which takes away the messaging certification, the MS-600 exam, which takes away the developer certification for Teams, and um, hopefully there's not going to be a lot of a lot more exams going away this year, a lot more certifications going away this year. I'm really hoping that Microsoft might even come out with some more. I know they are focused a lot on their applied uh, learning curriculum now, their applied skills, Microsoft applied skills, that's their new type of thing that's like a certification. I will put a link for the applied skills video. If you're not familiar with that, that's a big deal. I'll put a link in the description for you on that. All right, well, that's going to do it. Again, I hope you'll give me a like and a subscribe. 
Uh, only a very, very small percentage of people watching my videos is actually subscribed. And I really, if you would subscribe, it'll help me build my channel. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll talk to you in the next one.